What's going on, guys? So, I have a real serious, passionate love for Metal Gear Solid games. Although, I didn't actually play them on, like, the PSP. So, don't hate against me. Um, but I still love the games, like, regardless. Um, the one I played the most, probably Sons of Liberty. It was really, like, the first one I played. Then, eventually, I played the remake on GameCube. So, I got to play the first one, because I never had a PS1 to play it on. Um, but, so now, like... Out of excitement, of course, I got Ground Zeroes. Or I should say I re-downloaded it on my new PlayStation 4. And I just wanted to give it a run, but then I realized, oh, I totally want to talk about my thoughts, because this game is just awesome. So that's what this video is going to be about, is I'm just going to talk. I mean, I'm not just going to talk. I'm going to play the game a little bit, and I want to talk about just a couple of my thoughts on the game and features I'm excited about and the first one I'm gonna start because this is like a, a great view for it is uh, the base building like I know it's not gonna be like this on the ground or on an island I mean as far as I know would be really awesome if you could build in like a island base imagine you know what I'm saying trying to sneak into a player's island base you could build like all tropical and shit but we know that's not probably not the case um, it's more out there like on a big tanker ship which I think, <coughs> excuse me, uh, not a tanker ship, but you know, like a, a, an oil rig, and you build your base it however you want to, and then that's like your home base, that's your mother base, and you're, you send your soldiers out from there, and they come back there, and that's where all your stuff goes, and like that's really what you're doing for the game to build it up, and players can sneak into this, and you can defend it from other players, or you could sneak into your, uh, like a friend's, or another enemy's, or whoever's, you know, I'm excited personally to sneak into my brother's base and steal all his goats, because I know he likes goats. Maybe not, though, but I'm going to steal them anyways, because you can't stop me. But you get the idea that it's going to be amazing. So, like, it would be cool, though, you enter the base, and you got a guy in a tower, and, like, so the player's got to zoom in, and he's, like, imagine, like, all these guards, you know, you have chosen all of their path, their uh, patrol paths, and, like, maybe you get to, maybe you get to deal with their behavior as well. That'd be incredible if you got to fiddle with their behaviors and like you could make them more aggressive you know like uh i don't know what they would be aggressive like but just like some crazy badass bloodthirsty mercenary or some something like that you know private military soldier and you could just really customize like the, you can check the what they would screen. act as on your base you know maybe they don't take any prisoners and they just kill you right away or maybe they you could set them so they try to take you prisoner you know, or they try to kill you non-lethally. I'm gonna arm all my guys with the best, most high-tech lethal weapons, so that's not really an option for me. But if it's your choice, maybe it's an option for you. If it's in the game, which I... I mean, it, that's just one of those things I wouldn't expect. But then Hideo would be like, what's up? I just did it all, because that's what I'm doing for you guys. I'm doing it, doing it all. But I'm, I'm very excited about the, the base building. And then on top of that... Uh, you got the beautiful open world now that you get to roam through and there are basically side missions which is what they've shown us more or less and the story is obviously going to be incredible but I like the idea that you can just veer off from the story and go do your own mission your own operation that you've set up and your guys can help you out and you can even go as far as to play as a different character like maybe because they showed off, like, I, I think just made characters or side characters, but I think it would be incredible if you could play as um, just your soldier, you know, just this guy. Be like, we'll just call him Andrew Myers or something, and we'll say, oh, let's take Andrew Myers, and we're going to put him in the battlefield, and it's like you're working for Snake now. You know what I mean? So the character you were, which was, uh, what is it, Big Boss right now? You're Big Boss, and these are your soldiers under. You get to, like play for him, go do a badass mission, and take guys out with your freaking knife. Now, I'm addicted to the knife sense of amp. Area. I'm you sorry. The on your I think for now that's about all I want to talk about, because that's really what I'm most excited about at the moment, but I'm sure I'll make another video eventually. I also just wanted to get some little bit of gameplay of this. I know I kind of did a lot of standing around, but you know, I was getting really into it, and I really, 
really cannot wait for Metal Gear Solid 5. So I don't know what you guys think, but let me know if you're excited about the game too in the comments below or what you think about this video. And don't forget to like the video, share the video, and subscribe to the video. Oh my god, do it all.